The city has rolled out a repurposed bus to help homeless people get medical attention and access to shelters. This joins a fleet of ambulances and SUVs used by the CORE program. Mahal Annie Richardson takes us on board. It's called Crisis Outreach Response and Engagement, CORE, which started in 2021 by the Honolulu Emergency Services Department. Now the latest vehicle in its fleet is a retired city bus, funded through a federal grant that's been converted into a mobile medical unit. There's a driver and two to three emergency medical technicians. Once on board, the CORE bus can fit 12 people lying down and 17 seated. And if it's a full-size human being. Can you give us a scenario of what would be happening on the bus? So on the bus, after we are able to get the individuals on the bus, we have our medical equipment and supplies to ensure that before we take them over to the hygiene center or to the facility that they're going to be um, taken into, that we would check them out in case an emergency happens. Uh, we can help clean them up if need be. The City Department of Community Services says there are roughly 2,500 homeless people on the streets and roughly that same number in shelters. The core bus is part of an overall strategy to help get those who are willing into medical respites and shelters and create more beds. What you're going to see is a series of events that really bring us many types of beds. As I've been known to say, beds of many flavors, helping people on the street get into clean sheets. The whole idea here is to break that cycle of where people were being picked up, taken over to an emergency room, treated, put back out on the street, nowhere to go. The core bus will soon service the entire island on an as-needed basis. It comes with wraparound nonprofit services dedicated to the difficult journey of getting homeless off the streets. The core bus starts going on the road later this month. Reporting from the core bus, I'm Ahaleni Richardson, Hawaii News Now.